Hey guys, Professor Bill Comic Book University and Black Lightning, Cold Dead Hands, issue number one of six. This was a really good comic up until like the last couple of panels, not even pages, just panels. Uh, this is basically what half of the people are going to say, eh, not even half, honestly, honestly, it's like a 10, 15% minority who's going to be like, oh my god, this was horrible, this was so bad, they're becoming like Marvel. Yeah, 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 this is why nobody likes to listen to you. Anyway, <laughs> the idea here is that this is what it, it, you can see it in the news, you can see it in life, if you actually know people like this. This is a really messed up situation where Black Lightning is just trying to be a superhero, but <laughs> the problem is he's got to deal with the fact that he's a black superhero. It's in his name. It's in his name, you know? Um, and to be honest, maybe this is one of the reasons why the Justice League always keeps <laughs> Cyborg up in the Watchtower all the time, because and, and, and they used to keep John in the Watchtower all the time, too, because, like, yeah, no, nah, nobody's, nobody's going to be cool with you, man. <laughs> so, look, this was actually a really cool comic. I genuinely dug this. Everything that was in here, I feel, was extremely believable extremely believable on top of that the 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 idea that he's trying to deal with things oh doing different power stunts like the ability to propel himself not necessarily flight but propel himself he's talking about he's uh, learned how to be sneaky from batman 101 cyborg gave him the advice on how to use his electromagnetics to be able uh, magnetics to be able to fly you get a good idea of his powers and guys don't forget to check out in the description below black lightning explained in a minute it's one of my earlier ones so it's not my current format but a lot of people seem to like it. <laughs> so if you want to know who Black Lightning is, check out the description below. Black Lightning explained in a minute. On top of that, guys, the uh, the bottom half of this comic book, the very end, I didn't like the idea that his his friend, his girlfriend, whatever, is sitting there saying, oh, yeah, hey, man, um, hit me, you know, make it, make it look good, but not too good, and then get out of here because the cops aren't going to listen to you. She just overrode the cops several times, and then her only idea right now is hit me to make it look like you really did uh, kill these guys? Come on, man. Come on. That right there was a little bit bad, and it's hard to say it's bad because Tony Isabella is writing this, and he is one of the original creators. It's right there in the bottom. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm not a huge fan of that ending, but I guess they need to keep this story going some way, somehow. I think they could have done that better. I genuinely think they could have. That being said, I'm still going to give this comic a B plus. This was an enjoyable comic. I'm, I'm probably going to wind up reading all six of these issues. We'll see. But this is fun. All right, guys. Professor Bill, Comic Book University. Class dismissed.